Hey guys, I know it's been a while, but in this video we are inside of Color or Die, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to beat the game and how to get to the end. But anyway, make sure to like, subscribe, and now let's get into this. So, the first thing you want to do here is just take the black paint and go through that wall there, and now you're going to be red, and you just want to go around to the center where the red room is. And if you had any of the walls, just do that. Let's go ahead and pick up that paintbrush. Anyway, guys, I'm just going to be trying out a whole bunch of different games. So comment down below what games you want to see. And if you want to see more uh, color or, or dye videos, just comment down below. Okay, well, here's the red room. So we're going to go in through there. Going to pick up the screwdriver. And now the screwdriver vent room is really close. There's just like this, basically like a wall separating the two. You just have to go around that wall in the center there and open up the vent and now you can go through here. Now you're this is like a safe zone you can be in and you just have to do this parkour. And once you get to the end you can become the color orange and just get another paintbrush and you see that's where the cyan room was, so we'll have to go there later. But next thing we have to do is just find the orange room, just follow the way I'm going. Here's orange. There we go. And now we're yellow. So for yellow, you just want to go down here. Yeah. Looks like here's the monster coming. It came really close to us there. So there, got a hide. Here's the yellow room. And you see there's another room there that we're going to have to come back to later. But that's at like the very end. So you see it's going to use the saw there. But for now, we just need to go to the room on the right, and we're also need to come back to this room later at the very end once we get the key. But right now, we just have to do this parkour. It's kind of weird, like all these lines and boxes going around. And oh no, I fell there, but it's okay. I caught myself. And even if you do fall, you always respawn, so that's good. You don't have to restart. But now we're green. Get the paintbrush. We'll have to come back to that room with the key later. But for now, we just need to find the green room. Okay, so now I'm going to head down this way, just sort of following the wall. Oh, well, it looks like we need to hide here, maybe? Okay. Now, now we're just going to keep on going, following the side here, and now we'll get to the green room. So here we'll also need to come back when we find the triangle place there, but right now we get a paintbrush, and now we're the color teal. So now, if you remember earlier, when we did that first parkour room, and where the vent was with the screwdriver, we have to go back there through the parkour to get to the teal room. So let's just go around the map. So the most important thing is that knocking walls is just keeping your orientation about where you are. It's not really a maze, it's just like a giant room with many walls. Oh, that was a weird noise. But anyway, now we just need to go in here and do the parkour again. And let's go. I really don't like parkour, but this has a lot of it. So, yeah, you see how I just fell to my death there. But it's okay, because you respawn. There we go. Get the teal room. And now we get the triangle and the paintbrush. But something that's not very good about this is that you're not going to have a color, so you can't hide from the monster. Um, the only way to be safe is if you go into a room like this, like that one right there, or a hallway, because it's too short for the monster to go in. Does he have a name? I don't know if he has a name. If you do know his name, comment down below it. Okay, well now anyways, here we are. We can just put a triangle there. Now we're the color blue, so we can actually hide from the monster now. That's a lot better than just walking around. But now you're just going to want to go this way. Remember, that's where a pink room is going to be. Here you'll see the sign of the paintbrushes on it. We'll also have to go there later at like the very end. But I think we just go down here. Oh yeah, here we are. So this is the blue room. Yeah, uh, no more hiding on walls for a while. Okay, let's pick up this saw here. We'll then need to go up to here, where you'll see this room, where it's also a safe zone. And there's this weird little map on the wall. I don't know what that's for. But yep, we're a little bit over halfway there now. Uh, but now we just go ahead and go down here. We'll just go down the staircase. 
And we just need to head on this way. There's a purple room. Get a paintbrush. And you'll see these red and yellow walls there. And you just want to kind of hug the wall. Go this way. Ooh, looks like the monster's coming. Okay. Okay, looks like we're good. Go ahead and head on this way. Okay, Rome's at the safe zone. Well, now that we're at the safe zone, this is the zone where we can just sit here, rest, and we just want to come through this way on the other side and try to find, uh, you remember the room where there's two doors? Go ahead, yeah, get that paintbrush for later. Where there's two doors and we have to use our saw again to um, open up the left door. So now we just come through here. Basically just uh, trying to avoid the monster, going around the side. Oh, here we are. Okay. Okay, so now that we're there, we can just cut that other room open with our saw. Make sure to pick up that plank while we're there. Oh, that was a weird noise. Oh, more parkour. <laughs> I fell again. But anyway, we're just going to do a little simple parkour here. Get the paintbrush. Now purple, this is like the second to last color we need. And so now with this plank, uh... I forget. Yeah, I think we just need to go around here. Uh, there we go. Purple room. Now he's gonna wanna climb up the ladder and go over to the right here. That is gonna be where last one of the last few paintbrushes are gonna be. Make sure to not forget that, cause you'll have to come all the way back to this room. Uh, there. Just lay that board down there. Get the hammer. And you're gonna wanna go over to the right here. And go around that wall, staying on the left side. And there you go, open that up. Now we have the pink color. And now that we are pink, we just need to find the pink room, going through here. And if you ever see something like this, where it's like two walls next to each other, you can actually go in there, it's like a little secret room. I'm not sure how you're able to go into here, but if you guys want to know, maybe I'll find out how or I'll make a video on it. If you want to know, comment down below. And if you've made it this far into the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Okay, here's the pink room. Open that up. Now we get the key. And now with the key, we're going to go all the way back to, I think it's the yellow room. Whatever the room is with the two doors. And we have to go in there, open that up. Okay, here we are. Now when you go here, do all that crazy parkour again. And now we open up this room and we get, this should be the last paintbrush, but we must have forgotten one. So we're going to have to go back to the beginning. So now go here and you just want to pick a side and you just want to follow the edge of that side all the way back to the beginning or end, wherever. So just make sure you have the right orientation and... Uh, you can try to find a map somewhere if you want, but just the easiest thing, just know which way is forward and backward. And now that we've made it to the end, there, just need to go down the hallway to get that paintbrush. Let's go back to the safe zone, and now after a little rest, we can go out. And basically now what we're going to do is have to go all the way to the end, back the way we came. Because that is going to be where the room with the paintbrush was on it. And that room is now going to be open. See if that ever happens to you guys where you're waiting outside. He'll eventually teleport away. But anyway, back to what I was saying. We have to go to the room where the paintbrush was. Go through there. It'll now be open. And it's going to be this really cool room. You'll see when I get there. Ooh, there goes the monster. Yeah, so right now you can see I'm just staying on the right side. Just going back, moving in the same direction. And here we go. Now we made it to the room here. Let's go ahead and head in. So this room's really cool. We have all these like crazy lines everywhere, some music. And you see that the lines make some pictures. Like you see there, there's like a house. And over there, you see it's like a smiley face and me. And a light bulb and like, I think it's supposed to be a peace sign and a tree. But anyway, you're just gonna go to this little stool here, and there you get the white paint bucket. This is the final bit paint bucket you need. You just need to go all the way back to the beginning. And then you'll have like this final boss or boss room that you'll have to complete. So now I'm just gonna stay on the left side and just slowly make my way all the way back to the start. Here's that triangle room. You can rest there if you want. Now, 
Let's see. I mean, one of those weird noises, but anyways, let's just wait here. I think I'm out for the monster. Maybe not. But let's see. Here's the screwdriver room. When you get to the screwdriver no room, you know you're almost there. You're pretty close to the beginning. You just have to go around like a few walls. Here we go. Snake through those walls. And here we go with the safe zone. So now once you go here, you are so close to the end. You just need to exit and put the white paint on that door there on the back. Now you choose one of these doors. And one of the doors, it's all randomized. It's different every time. I guess I'll just go to the first door here. So you'll be in this really cool room. There'll be a countdown. And you just need to wait for it to be over. And then you'll be put in your room, whatever it is. Okay, it looks like something sort of like Flood Escape, where we have to go up, do some parkour. I told you guys I don't like parkour, but it looks like I have to do some here. Okay, let's go ahead and head up here. Okay, doing okay so far. Let's head on this pole. And it looks like some more to hop on. I don't really know where I'm supposed to go from here, though. There's nowhere else to go, really. I don't know. Am I supposed to like, on something else? I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do there. Well, okay, it looks like I didn't escape, but I do get a win. If you want to double your wins, it is like 30 Robux, so if you guys want to do that. I'm not, though. I think it's easier just to play. But anyways, go back to the lobby, and thank you guys all for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and hopefully you guys will all be able to be an escape. And once you get an escape, you can do Chapter 2. And anyways, thanks for watching. Comment down below what you want to see next. And make sure to like and subscribe.